hey guys welcome or welcome back to my channel for today's video i will be customizing this mason jar for my daughter with this unicorn theme if you guys like this video or if you guys enjoy this video please like and comment below subscribe to my channel for more videos like this and so much more thank you guys for watching let's get started I will be placing all supplies that I've used in this video below in the description box. Here I'm going to be painting over my mason jar to create my canvas and my background for my unicorn. Now guys, I lost footage. I thought I was recording, I wasn't. I went ahead and add the pink and I blended between the purple and the pink. And then I had outlined my unicorn. Now as you can see, I'm still outlining it. And then I'm gonna let it sit and dry for a bit before I start adding in the details. While I'm waiting for the unicorn to dry, I'm just going to be adding some clouds. Now you can see I'm doing a little swoop motion and then I'm filling it in and then after it dries, I'll be going over it again to get it a more opaque. Now that our unicorn is dried a bit, I'm going to be going over it again just to get it a bit more opaque that way I'm not seeing the background color so much. So I'm just going over it again and then I'm going to allow it to dry a bit more before I get into the next section. While I'm waiting for the unicorn to dry, I'm going to be adding some Elmer's glue, wood glue, to my horn. That way I can attach my gold sprinkles to the horn. Next, I'm going to be outlining 
the unicorn and placing the details where I'd want it while it's still wet. That way I can get a good look or a good idea of where I want everything to be. Now I'll be painting in my main into my colors that I'm thinking of using. I went with pink, turquoise, and blue. I feel like these are unicorn colors, so I just went with those. Now that I'm complete with coloring the unicorn and putting in the colors where I would like them to be, it's time to outline and to give our unicorn some features. Thank you. 
Next, I'll be adding some grass and flowers around the mason jar just to give it a bit more details. Next, I'll be using a Q-tip just to add some dots around my grass so I can put in the details for my flowers. I'll be using pink and white just to add some contrast to the colors. Next and final, I did use a sealer spray to spray around the mason jar just so that it wouldn't easily peel off because it is paint. We want it to be preserved so I did spray a sealer spray around it and I did have my husband spray over the lid because this wasn't a brand new jar. This was a jar that we had for a long time. So if you have a jar in your home that you wanted to just up upgrade or decorate you can also get that as well to spray over the lid and this is our final results after spraying it, it looks so glossy it looked like it just came like that if you guys enjoy this video don't forget to like and comment let me know what you guys think below i would love to know what you guys think subscribe to my channel for more videos like this and more i have so much more in mind and coming you guys don't want to miss out so subscribe to my channel that way you won't miss out on any of my uploads thank you guys for watching bye